This nail design was inspired by the ancient art of palmistry, which is better known as palm reading. I thought this would be a perfect look for you if you were going as a fortune teller for Halloween or just wanted to do something fun. So if you want to know how I achieved this nail look, please stay tuned. Start off with a base coat to protect your natural nails. Then paint on a coat of a natural skin tone. This one happens to be NYC's Fashion Safari. Using a little bit of a chocolate brown nail polish, this one is Lug Your Designer Baggage from China Glaze. I'm going to be putting a little bit of this onto a ripped piece of sponge and then subsequently dabbing it onto my nail sparsely. And this is supposed to give it kind of an aged look, an aged paper sort of look. Using a black striper nail polish, I'm going to be painting on some triangles. Some of them are upside down, some of them are right side up, and some of them have lines in the middle. And these all represent earth, air, fire, and water. You can see these triangles in the pictures at the beginning and in the video clip at the end of the video. Now comes the fun part where you can start the eye on the middle finger. I'm using a cream white nail polish from Pure Ice. Um, any cream white will do. And I'm doing a rough shape of an eye on the middle finger. Then I'm going to go in and clean it up with a white striper nail polish. Reinforcing that eye shape, I'm taking the black striper nail polish again and just making an outline on the white. It should look something like this. And now you can do the iris. You can choose any color you want, but I use Sally Hansen's Pacific Blue. Just do a circle in the middle of the eye shape. And once that's done, you can paint in a small dot for a pupil, as well as a small white dot to represent light shining on the iris. For an extra added bit of fun, I cut up some old eyelashes and glued them onto the eye just to make it look a little bit more realistic. And if you are wondering, these eyelashes do stay on for at least a day or two if you're careful, so they should be fun for Halloween night. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and thank you so much for watching and subscribing. Bye!